from Anshay Svar Beth El Emeth Congregation. It's time to take 10 minutes for Torah with Rabbi Joel Finkelstein. Welcome to our discussion of what is Hanukkah. Now, if I ask an average person, what is Hanukkah, what do you mean? Hanukkah is you light the candles. If you look in the Gemara, you see something very surprising, that Hanukkah is almost not about lighting the candles. The Gemara in Shabbos says, L'shan Acheres, after Hanukkah was over and the next year came and they had to decide how are we going to commemorate what happened and transpired, the miracle. Kavum, they established it. Vasaum, they made it. Yomim Tovim Bahalavahoda. Yomtovs, with Halel and Oda. Yomtovs? Is, what is, what is Hanukkah? Is Hanukkah Yomtov? Could I say good Yomtov? With Halal and Oda. The Yantav with Halal. What's a Yantav without Halal? What does it mean? So Rashi says, it's not a Yantav. Yantav means that you're not allowed to work. No. It's only for one thing. Yantav vis-a-vis Halal. There's only one thing to, to read the Psalms of Thanksgiving. Toward the end of the Psalms, the beautiful Thanksgiving, Hallelujah, Hodu Lashem, give praise to God. Ha'oshana, Oshiana, Oshia, God save us. These are the things which, which should be said on Hanukkah. What is the essence of Hanukkah? What is Hanukkah? Hanukkah is Hallel. And in your prayers as well. Now saying in the prayers is interesting. Because when do you have to mention something in a prayer? You see, if today's Rosh Chodesh, and I get up in front of God and I say, praying for, for rain, I'm praying for, for wisdom, and I don't mention Rosh Chodesh, I don't mention Shabbos, you say, what kind of prayer is that? It's Shabbos? You didn't talk about Shabbos? It's Rosh Chodesh? You didn't talk about Rosh Chodesh? But, but Hanukkah, you would say, what is Hanukkah? Hanukkah is lighting the candles. Say, well, maybe Hanukkah is saying the Hallel. But during your Shimon Ezra, do you have to mention it? If you don't mention it, it's inappropriate? Rashi says yes. Rashi seems to say yes. It's not clear. The Rambam says, the rabbis instituted these eight days that what? He says, you may simcha v'halel, days of joy and halel. Days of joy. Where did he get that? Days of joy. Oh, Yom Tov. When the Talmud said it was a Yom Tov, he says, well, it's not a Yom Tov. So you're allowed to work, but there's joy. So what does that mean, joy? Does he mean you have, you have to have a feast every day? V'halel. And also you should say halal. So we're not to agree with that. He wanted to say that, no, it's the days of joy, and the joy expresses itself in halal. Whenever we're really happy, we should say halal, to thank God. Umad likim The Rambam almost as an afterthought says, these days were established for joy in halal, and we light candles. Shouldn't you say they were established for Hallel and candle lighting? What do you mean? They were established for Simcha and Hallel, and we light candles. It sounds like the candle is a whole different story. The candles are not the essence, certainly according to Rashi, and the Rambam, I want to argue as well, it's not the essence. That's something else. He says, these days are called Hanukkah, and you're not allowed to give eulogies or fast, and lighting the candles is a mitzvah. Now, these days are days of simcha. You can't have uh, eulogies. And then, we also light the candles. The candles are not the essence. Unless you want to say that what are the candles? The Ramam says the candles are to show the miracle. When you, you light the candles and you show the miracle, that's a form of Hallel, Thanksgiving. And that's an essence of Hanukkah. What is Hanukkah? Hallel and expresses himself with the lighting of the candles, which tells the story of the miracles and praises God. The Me'iri says that it's the fact that you're not allowed to give eulogies. That's the, that's the Yom Tov aspect. That's what makes it happy at all. It's not sad. It's not really happy, but it's not sad. You can't fast. And then he agrees with Rashi that you could, the, the prayers are important and finishing the Hala. The Piske Riyaz, Rabbi Yishai Detrani, an Italian rabbi, he says, we, we establish for a Hallel 
And we thank God for the miracle with the lighting the candles and mentioning in prayer. He says, this expression of the Talmud as to what they affix this holiday for, what the purpose of this holiday is, cannot be talking about everything but the candles. It's got to be talking about the candles. The Thanksgiving is the candles. That's why when we light the candles, we say, these candles we light, they're holy, and we have no right to use them. These candles are in order to praise you and thank you. When the Talmud says these days were established for hallow, they meant the candles, but not the candles we're thinking of, where you light the candles and you, I don't know, sing a song and go to sleep. It's the candles of Thanksgiving. What is Hanukkah? Hanukkah is to light candles out of Thanksgiving. And here's the next point, a final point. As the Shemi Shmuel says, the rabbis didn't just institute Hallel and Hoda, that you should say Hallel, you should say Modim, you should say Alanisim, the insertions in the prayer, you should light the candles, because then what is Hanukkah? Hanukkah is an episodic thing. In the morning, in the evening, I do some Hanukkah things. Let's bring the dreidel. But no, maybe it means it's a day of Thanksgiving. There's eight days of Thanksgiving. I should feel Thanksgiving. How does that express itself? Candles, prayers. Anytime I'm praying, got to mention that. Expresses itself in the Hallel, lighting candles. It expresses itself. But the, but the essence of Hanukkah, what is Hanukkah? It's Thanksgiving. Last year, Hanukkah fell on Thanksgiving. Very appropriate. Because Thanksgiving is modeled after Sukkot. Sukkot is Thanksgiving. Hanukkah is also modeled after Sukkot. That's why it's eight days. They weren't able to celebrate Sukkot that year, so they celebrated eight days. Hanukkah is Thanksgiving because Hanukkah is Sukkot. Sukkot is Thanksgiving. It's eight days of Thanksgiving. And the Hallel stems from that Thanksgiving. Not just like a regular Yontif, but particularly as a holiday, particularly dedicated to Thanksgiving. What is Hanukkah? Hanukkah is Thanksgiving. Thank you for joining us here at the Anshay Sefer Beth Lamed's congregation for our discussion of the Hanukkah, various holidays. Join us each week for the discussion of the Parsha, how-to videos. We have a series on business ethics recently put out. And join us each week here at Anshay Sefer Beth Lamed's congregation here in Memphis, Tennessee. Thank you, Jason Lefkowitz, our producer. Thank you. This has been 10 Minutes for Torah with Rabbi Joel Finkelstein. To learn more, visit asb.org.